Okay, this is the grand staff. Grand staff is used by instruments that have a wide range that reaches into the high notes, the treble notes, and down into the bass notes. So piano obviously uses the grand staff. Usually has a brace here. Um, marimba also uses the grand staff. I'm sure there are some other instruments, but I'm not really sure of what they are. Um, treble clef works just like the treble clef did that you just saw with Every Good Boy Does Fine and F-A-C-E, ledger lines going up. Uh, bass clef, all cows eat grass are the spaces. Green buses drive fast always are the lines. And again, ledger lines going up, ledger lines going down. The only odd thing about this, other than the fact that we're stacking two of them together, is that this C, because we have every here, so there's E, D, C, one ledger line below the treble clef is a C, and this top line is A, so we have A, B, C. This C above the bass clef is the same note as this C. Now you can tell which one it's written you're not going to see a C written in the middle like that. There would be no way to tell whether that was treble clef or bass clef. But this one is tied to the treble clef. This one is tied to the bass clef. And you could possibly even have these notes. The notes on each clef could cross over. So I could have a B on the treble clef. And I could have a D on the bass clef. And this note is actually higher than this note. So you have to read carefully when you're reading ledger lines in between the two staves on the grand staff. Okay, one moment and I'll be back with the C clef business.